everyone it's me sally aka sailor tarot magic and we're gonna do tarot today for earth signs taurus virgo capricorn if you're enjoying my videos please like share and subscribe and comment <laughs> and for a full reading and full picture watch your sun moon and rising element reading video okay so let's get started just going to shuffle my cards I'm back in the basement because I needed better picture quality. So we're moving up in the world. Let's shuffle my tarot cards. Very excited to get back into the thick of things. Woo! Here we go. Okay. All right, so what is the message for earth signs? Give me one oracle card. What do they need to know? Envy causes wrinkles, and that's reversed. So you may be having an issue looking at what other people have and comparing yourself to other people. And you kind of have to stay in your own lane and focus on what it is you want to build. And everybody is on their own path. So don't feel like you're behind. I feel like you constantly feel like you're behind, but everything happens for a reason. And even the setbacks are a learning lesson to keep you on your true path. So what is the message for earth signs? Give me five cards. What is the present energy? Knight of Swords reversed. Okay, so this is this is directly related to this and what I was just talking about. So I feel like you're rush, rush, rushing, and then because you're rushing, you're missing details and things you need to get done. You're missing details of things people are telling you, and you're kind of like forgetting a lot of things, and it's just kind of um, a clusterfuck, so to speak. And you may be feeling a little scatterbrained. If you slow it down, you'll give yourself more time to focus on things. Um, you don't want to half-ass. You don't want to haphazardly do things just because you feel like you're under a time crunch. But I feel like you're putting on, you're putting this time crunch on yourself. This is not like actually happening. So try to dial it back a bit and slow down what is the past energy seven of wands reversed okay so this is telling me that in the past you felt like you had to prove yourself and be at a certain level and be at a certain position and when you didn't meet that certain position in that time you felt like you were behind and that's why you're in this present state so think about your goals and is this what you really want or are you trying to be where everyone else is at because this is this is what's causing these emotions and feelings and it's kind of destructive like you feel like you're being productive but it's also destructive at the same time so taking a beat taking a minute like may be the best thing for you right now all right, so what is the future energy? Two of Wands. I love when the cards explain what I just said. So again, Two of Wands is saying, take a pause. Look at where to go from here. Usually there's two or more paths or decisions you can take. So once you take a minute and realize, okay, I was doing everything and I was like, you know, in the clouds or my my focus was foggy. But now I see things clearly and I visualize how I want my life to be. So this is what I'm going to do. So if you take that moment, things will be clear to you. You'll receive that clarity and and it won't be so muggy to you. Why is this all happening? The sun. I love the sun. OK, so this is saying that. At the end of the day, you just want to be happy. And for you and this moment, being happy is accomplishments and stability and making money. And that's totally fine. But you need to make sure that your mind is in the right spot and in the right headspace. Because 
if your energy and abilities aren't aligned with your goals, you're not going to get anywhere and you're going to be in a hamster wheel. So take care of yourself to clear your mind and things will happen the way you want them to. What's the best possible outcome? Ace of Wands. Okay, so this is telling me that, again, once you take a minute to figure out what it is you want, whatever you put that energy and focus on will be yours. And this isn't just for um, like career and work accomplishment. This is also um, for personal relationships and your networks and the people around you. Um, if you want to rekindle a romance, that'll happen for you. It's all, it's just about focusing on that thing, putting time into it, and it will flourish. And then you'll be able to not have as many wrinkles, I guess. Uh, <laughs> that's the reading for you, Earth Signs. And for a personal reading, feel free to message me on Instagram. Thanks, and I'll see you next time. Bye.